Well, hello Facebook friends. Uh, we are on our first day of not being on lockdown. But guess what? There's nothing open. So you might as well still be on lockdown. But anyways, I just thought I'd show everybody. Uh, I got the smoker going and uh, decided to, uh, to do myself um, a little batch of, uh, oh, oh, look at that. Now those are some chicken legs. They've been perfectly smoked for about two and a half, three hours. And I'm just waiting uh, for the barbecue. Oh yes, it's just about ready. So that's been smoked for, uh, oh, gotta say hello to Molly, everybody. Hi Molly, Molly. Yeah, yo baby. That's my baby girl. Well, not really a baby girl anymore. She's seven, eight. And uh, just look at the, uh, it's either, well, not really cold today, but not really hot. Maybe low 70s. And uh, yay, I get my riding lawnmower on the weekend. Happy Father's Day to me. Yes, yes, yes. But uh, anyways, I will... Uh, We'll transfer over some, uh, transfer over the, the chicken onto uh, the barbecue and I'll uh, be back. Alrighty, wow. So anybody that doesn't have a smoker, you don't know what you're missing. I, uh, I don't have one of those ones that barbecue in both, but so yeah, I'd say I put these on it gonna have sorry guys a little a little awkward trying to operate the camera and uh, camera these are so juicy they are just amazing and I'm trying to keep them in the middle so that we don't have to flare up I'll just put that over here cool down there we go. So, this is just really to finish them off. Um, they are absolutely, actually, I am going to turn two off and I will just operate off of the one so that it's not direct heat. Sorry, guys. I'm a little cockeyed today. But those of you that follow my channel long enough realize that, well, that's really just normal. Not straight, but you know, that's okay. Everybody's allowed to be a little different. And so, like I say, I'm going to put it down. I'm gonna bring these up to temp a little bit. Um, they're already technically cooked. But the barbecue sauce, um, don't know if you guys can get this down south or not, but uh, Bullseye, they have, uh, they have about three or four different kinds. If you can't, oh my goodness, it is just amazing. Great barbecue sauce. But uh, anyways, we will uh, put this down, let it, uh, let it warm up. And uh, I'll be back shortly. Well, since I'm here, why not give you the whole spiel of, you know, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe because it costs you nothing. But it helps me as a new channel starting out to say, hey, YouTube, look at this guy's a crazy, crazy kind of guy. And uh, then they'll start putting people my way. And I'm just about to that hundred, so uh, feel free to uh, share my channel. Um, I would much appreciate it. And uh, yeah, from here, uh, if you share, like, subscribe, and uh, ring uh, just the little notification bell, will uh, let you know whenever I post new videos. So 
we will go from there. Well, 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 I found myself a photographer. I like it. So, this you smoke for a few hours. And like I say, it was probably closer to three hours that I smoked these. But just generously, they're already juicy as it is. And I'm gonna get myself one of those uh, professional uh, barbecue sauce brushes next time I'm at the store. I've, I've received a couple of them, but I tend to break them. I don't know, might be my size or something, but whatever goes in these big bear paws kind of hurts a little bit. Okay. Pretty basic, I'm sure everybody can do it, but it this just adds a kind of sweet sweetness to the smoke. And all I can say is there's people that do uh, brine. I don't like to use brine. Um, I feel it takes away from the takes away from the um, goodness and the taste of the chicken, so what I will do is just leave it for about 10-15 minutes. I'm just on low. And uh, flip it, do it again, wait 10 minutes, and I have, uh, I don't know what, what you call them down there, but we call them skull potatoes up here, thinly sliced potatoes in a uh, sauce. Uh, what have I got? Cheddar and bacon tonight. So, anyways. Well, guys, here we go. I've already flipped. Oops. Oops. I already flipped them. Just done a nice little coating on them now. And, uh, you know, uh, I'm going to invite everybody for supper. have a backlog at the uh, border sorry guys but nothing I can do about that one and uh, so that means that you won't be here for dinner but you know uh, it's not a problem I, I do think whoever is home for dinner tonight will uh, yeah, it'll be all right. I would have put down a little bit more if the border would have been open is uh, Sam I'm sure you would have you know, rushed up here from, uh, from, uh, I guess it's South Carolina, and, uh, you're only, I don't know, 13 hour drive away, not a big Might have been a little bit cold and chewy by the time you got here, but, you know, that's all right. And, uh, you can pick Marge up on your way, uh, Margie up on your way, but, okay. So just give it a little, never, never, never have too much barbecue sauce on your last pass. Because if it's not sticky, then it's not worthwhile eating. They say normally with this many, you should really use about two cups of barbecue sauce. down below as to uh, how I did them. And, like I say, 10 minutes later, they're gonna be yummy.